Hey y'all, it's Miss J. I'm out here in Las Vegas at the Children's Museum. Now the Children's Museum has moved. If you do MapQuest and you come up with a Las Vegas Boulevard address, it's the wrong address. They're at, um, they're on Promenade, which is a newer location. It's off the highway, and I wouldn't know how to tell you how to get here, but if you go to their website, you can get the correct address. The building looks like this. It's a brand new building, and this is the Children's Museum of Las Vegas. 360 Promenade. I believe that's the correct address. When you come into the museum, of course, there's the gift shop. If there's a birthday party going on, they have a little table here for birthday party check-in. You pay over there, and there's a food area because they don't allow food in the museum. So they have a little, some tables and chairs set up for you. Emperor is asleep. So I'm going to show you some of the things that are here while he's sleeping. Waterworld is one of the first exhibits you'll come into. They have Toddler Town Fantasy Festival. The Children's Museum has three floors. I'm on the third floor now and in one section is Young at Art, which creative place for your little one to discover their many talents. I love these colors. A kaleidoscope.
So I just came out of the hurricane stimulator and it's like cold when you get in there, when you get in there and the wind starts blowing. And when I came out, my face is tingly and my eyes, you know, a little bit because it's like wind, a wind tunnel kind of sort of. And my hair feels refreshed. <laughs> so it's, it's a funny experience. It goes up to 75 miles per, um, per hour. The wind is 75 miles per hour in there. It was interesting. And um, I'm still asleep, so I'm gonna go see what else I can get into. Now I love this. It's all about choices. They have an exhibit where you can choose the people then and now, their healthy choices or their unhealthy choices. And this is great for kids. Love this. And Bruce's a little young for this exhibit right here, but we will be going through it when he wakes up. <laughs> have a game show find a label what's in the label which is oh so important love that you teach your kids how to read a label so that they can help with the shopping and when you say no then they'll know why because they'll have looked at the label and see the healthy or unhealthy choices and they have the sun protector fact sun yeah sun protector factor so that's red again I love this because you can empower your own child to learn about different things and then when you are with them or are not with them, if they have the information and they see it right here in their language, big, bold, colorful, with pictures, then you won't have such a hard time explaining it to them and they will understand it. They also have find your balance. about help having a healthy, ha balanced lifestyle. This is great. I've been to a couple of museums where they have um, instituted foods into it, different exhibits. And this seems like a really, really good one. A lot of hands-on stuff to do. Brain builders. Let's make a meal here. 
the cool pirate ship that they have. Fantasy festival, a fantasy place where children can do what they do. Yes, Emperor. You like to go on the ship? Go ahead. Navigate. Okay. Navigate. Mama. Come steer the ship. <laughs> Emperor, can you steer the ship? I don't know. People mutiny. Mutiny.